welcome back to my channel 876 recipes TV so in this video I am gonna do skinless baked chicken and also use cheese pineapple to make a pineapple drink and these are the spices that I use to season the chicken missing from the group are paprika and onion powder as well as salt so I use half teaspoon of each spices. This video will only be in pictures. You will only see pictures. I clean up the chicken, wash it with lime juice, rinse with water. If you look at my other videos, you will see how I do that, right? And then I pat dry each piece of chicken with a piece of paper towel i remove the skin from the chicken because i'm doing skinless baked chicken however i leave the fats intact because i need the fats to render while the chicken is in the oven baking and this prevents me also from adding oil to the chicken yeah man so now i'm gonna add all the spices to the chicken the spices are added to the chicken, including two cloves of garlic that I mince. The spices and the garlic rub onto the chicken. So I'm using fresh herbs, onion, scallion, and pepper that I mince into a chopper. And then I add it to the chicken as well. And then mix it in to the chicken, you know. So then I put the chicken into a baked dish and then I cover it and allow it to marinate for about four or six hours because it was really early. After the chicken marinated, I bake it into a preheated oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for one hour, 40 minutes covered and 20 minutes uncovered. So this is the chicken after 40 minutes. Then I remove the foil paper and then return it to the oven for an additional 20 minutes. So after an hour, I remove the baked chicken from the oven and this is it. Really juicy, well seasoned so it is full of flavor and very nice. Yeah man, so this is my skinless baked chicken. So this pineapple is called cheese pineapple. It's straight out of my grandfather's small garden at home, at his home. So I don't have to worry about chemicals or anything like that. Yeah man, so what I did was to use a kitchen brush and scrub the pineapple skin until it is really clean. So I'm going to put a piece of ginger root into the pineapple drink and then I'm going to squeeze the juice of two green limes. Basically I remove the head and the bottom of the pineapple then blend in enough water. I use filtered water and then I strain using a strainer and then I strain again using a clean dish towel. Yeah man and that's the pineapple juice right there or drink if you want to call it sweeten it with your favorite sweetener i use granulated sugar then i added the juice of two green limes and there is my pineapple drink quite refreshing this was an easy simple sunday dinner nothing fancy just simple and nice finger licking good juicy well seasoned so many words I can use to describe my cooking. If you want a real authentic Jamaican cooking, subscribe to my channel, share my videos, click the post notification bell. Yeah man, thanks for watching. What would until next time? Big up on yourself.